You sound like the kid in front of the amp at Steve's. <laughs> <laughs> slide that's okay. it to, okay. to get you because then they actually sound intentional to yeah. keep the fluid motion going okay you did it once in it where it was good but there was a couple other spots where you either did nothing or sure it was you're just hitting a bum note or something you know? okay okay so actually so let's if you want to try it sure. let's try that again yeah yeah Uh, an inch can make a huge difference. Um, you kind of uh, get a feel for your own personal taste as far as placement goes. You try it out, you listen to it, and if you don't like it, before you reach for the EQ, before you do anything else, uh, move the mic. Try it, uh, try it an inch away, try a different angle on it. Um, when I go in, I typically will uh, start with maybe a 45 degree angle pointing inwards towards the uh, center of the uh, toms and the snares. Um, and uh, and use that as a starting point. Um, for the most part, after a while, you get a feel for what works and what doesn't. And same with mic uh, selection as well. Um, you'll get some preferences. Uh, depending on what you're trying to accomplish, you'll choose different mics for their different characteristics. And, um, and again, go from there. If you don't like the sound, swap out the mic. Um, once you're happy more or less with the mics, you can then fine-tune pre's as well because the pre that you pair with the, uh, with the microphone will, uh, will also change the sound uh, far more subtly. Uh, what's more important is uh, that initial mic selection. Yeah. 
uh, some uh, drum recording right now, and uh, while I normally use uh, a typical stereo miking technique, XY or ORTF, uh, in this case I want a wider sound than you get with either of those, and so I used a spaced pair, and uh, the difference is quite striking. Much wider sound fields, um, things spread, pan across quite well, uh, and it's even collapsing in mono. And if it's not collapsing in mono properly, you do have to play with the placement a little bit. It builds up. For the other ones, I think they're okay because they're not as. Yeah, they're rough a little bit, and it's all okay. Okay. That's what I noticed on those first two um, lines of the last take that you like. Yeah. They were very spiky. Oh. And, and this one here is nice and smooth. Yeah. It, it just sounds, and that gives it a, a very intentional sound. Strong ones have it their way. Others seek the permission to say, won't you say? Sweetness with honey 